Hey y'all, come on in. I'm cooking. Cooking up a little something, something. go ahead and make that crust and drain off the oil. We're going to be making some um, zucchini and squash spaghetti. And I'm going to make some uh, crust. It's going to take about 45 minutes to cook. So let me get this stuff going real quick and then we will work on the crust. Babe, can you open those cans and um, chicken right there and uh, drain it. Today in the kitchen, I have my husband. You won't see him, yeah. but he in here with me. Just next door. Just uh, right next door. Let me get out of here. He stuck to his girl like a bird to a feather. We sit together, I'm telling you from the start, you can't take me apart from my guy. I could use a bigger skillet than this, but this this will this will do. A bigger skillet, but this will do. For now, mm -hmm. Take you 40 minutes, but you'll make it here eventually. Um, um. Uh -huh. yeah. Hey y'all, come on in. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna turn this to the side and show y'all how we're gonna make this crust so we can get it in the oven while we work on the rest of this stuff. Babe, don't you think I need a bigger skillet? It's on the other side. It sure did, didn't it? gonna move this to the side for now. It's gonna still be cooking, but I'm gonna shift it off to the side. So what we're gonna do is make our crust. And I think I'm gonna have to use the oven, the crust thing down here. I shouldn't have started it before, but yeah, all right. I'll let it cool off. So I'm trying to make why you not using your stove. Um, okay. I'm trying to make a crust by using chicken. 
Okay, I'm using canned chicken. And then after I use the canned chicken, we're going to add two eggs and some um, Parmesan cheese. So we're trying to substitute this for low carb, right? So that's what we're doing. Over on my oven, I've got my noodles getting ready. All right. And I'm just going to these are just being blanched a little bit. We're not going to overcook these because we don't want mush. All right. Just going to barely let them get unthawed. Because the people, the people wasn't in the um, deli to do my stuff. So now what we're going to do is add some eggs. We're going to crunch this up. We're going to add some eggs and we're going to add some Parmesan. All right. So we're going to get this going good. You can season it. I'm just going to put a little everything green on here. All right. And like I said, I'm using this so you can see me and don't have to look at the back of my head or anything. And I don't have to move around a lot. All right, so what we're gonna do is, we need Parmesan cheese, and we need a couple of eggs. And we're gonna get these patted out. This is my everything green. Okay, this is my seasoning for my crust. The crust needs to taste good, okay? And uh, I'm going to add a little salt and a little pepper. And we're going to get this padded out because it's going to cook a little bit. All right. Let's get us two eggs. One. Two. Okay. I'm gonna get that working out real good. That's called a binder, right? And then we got Parmesan. So hold on a second. Y'all doing all right today? <laughs> How y'all doing today? So we're going to make the crust. Hey, Willie, we, I told you, man, we're going to have to get together. We've been playing hit and miss. And I went shopping, and Ed found his stuff, and I found me some stuff. So I'm going to use Parmesan cheese. That's one. We want to get this tight, okay? We're going to add some more of another one and this is going to be our crust all right and what we're going to do is make our crust and then we're going to come back over here and finish cooking our ground beef all right now this is low carb if you going if you going to do it you got to learn how to cook some stuff and i pray y'all all are having a blessed day i have had the most blessed day this is chicken all right, we're making a, a crust. Instead of using bread for the pizza, we're going to make a crust out of eggs, out of chicken, out of Parmesan cheese, okay? That's all we're doing. Um, that's what I read, and that's what they said I could use. They said I could make a chicken crust. I could make a, um, I could make a cauliflower crust, all right? 
And so what I'm going to do is take this, um, this pan and I'm going to spray it. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. How y'all doing? Hey, Aisha. Let me see the comments. I haven't been seeing the comments. Um, what is the comments? What was the question? Uh, let's see what somebody said. Hold on one second. I'm going to read it to myself. Did someone say that in the comments? He did. Let's see. Yeah, I use my soap. Oh. I'm going to stay out of y'all com conversation. Because y'all ain't even focused on what I'm doing. I'm using my stove. I got it's on right now. It's got a boiler on it. I don't, I don't know. I don't know why I can't use my whole kitchen. So, does it bother you? Because I'm cooking right here for y'all to see me. Gee, Um. I need some spray. So I'm basically going to spray this and make me a little crust. All right? And then I'm going to do my spaghetti. Make sure it's tight enough because I want all the water to cook out of it. I need a little bit more to dry out, just a little bit more. You got to feel, you got to know what stuff should feel like. Okay. 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 Here we go. And we're going to press this all the way out. I'm going to put my dump bowl right there. We're going to press this out. Okay. You want a thick pan crust or a thin pan crust? Gonna see how this Got the oven on 400.
We're going to see what this does. There's a lot of people on Facebook that are low carb people. And I've been going and looking, seeing how I can change up some stuff. Because I mean business about um, my weight loss. So I'm going to see how this turns out. Okay. It's not, you can always do a new thing. All right. And that's how I see it. And if it don't turn out, I'll figure out something else to do with this. But this is what it is supposed to be. All right. So we're going to get this in the oven. We're going to put this in the oven, 450, I mean on 400 for 45 minutes, all right? So we're going to put this in the oven on 400 degrees for 45 minutes. And I'm going to set the timer. Okay. If it need longer, we'll put it in there longer. All right. Now we're going to work on our um, spaghetti. And this spaghetti is, um, this spaghetti is made out of um, squash and zucchini and I'm only blanching it a little bit because it's gonna cook in my noodles I don't want I don't want it to get in my sauce I mean, Um, you might see me lean when I cook because I have a problem with my back. And so sometimes I lean, sometimes I stand up. Let me get, let me, let me tell you something. I don't know who you are. I don't know how to pronounce your name. But if you would quit going back and forth and arguing with anybody on here, ain't nobody coming for you on my page. All right? Now, Demadre... Do not say nothing else to this lady at all. I mean, don't, don't go back and forth with these people. We don't even know. Because it comes back on me. Ain't nobody coming for nobody. I don't like that, I don't like that street talk. Nobody coming for nobody. Because everybody can get it today. It don't make no sense that we can't get along every time you turn around, somebody coming for somebody. It just don't make no sense. Y'all got to do better. Grown people, all this slang, don't come for me. Don't do, what's the problem? I'm the one cooking. Have I came for you? Do not respond back to nobody. And you'll be just fine. Let me find my thing. I get so tired of this. Every day it get harder and harder to come on him because of foolishness. The question was asked, do I cook on my stove? Of course I do. I just got it. And I don't even know why Demadre asked that. But if it's going to upset y'all like that, it shouldn't. We got to get down to what's really wrong. Other people just want to enjoy the cook. Just don't say nothing to each other. Don't comment. Don't say nothing. That's a distraction from the enemy. Y'all don't let the devil take y'all joy. And I said what I said. 
And I called it what it is. I'm not afraid to call it what it is. We're going to keep on cooking on him. All right? Um, so what I'm doing now is browning this uh, ground beef. Because I'm going to use it two times. I got sausage and I got ground round in here. All right? I'm going to drain my pasta because it's really vegetables. And if you cook it too long, they're going to be soggy. Because they're going to go inside the spaghetti sauce. So we're going to turn that off. Let me get my drainer. If I can find, I don't even know where all my stuff is. Hold on one second. Hold on, y'all. Takes me a minute to find everything. So I'm taking it off the eye and I'm gonna go drain it. Okay, I'm going to go drain the squash and the zucchini. Nobody coming for nobody. Ooh, I'm going to watch that type of mentality. Oh, this is my spirit. We have international conversations in the world. So, this is the pasta, which is nothing but squash and zucchini. If you need to look inside, I'll show it to you. Um, is my people on here? Hey, Loretta. Is Dandelion, Calvin, Willie, Jermaine, Tiffany? Is my people on here? This witchcraft has got to stop, and I'm not going to play with it on my page. Hey, Mother Ruby Cross. Um, I could be sitting down cooking and I'm standing up. And one minute you come over here, you want to know why I'm so big and why I'm so fat. And when I'm trying to show you the decisions I'm making, then you want to come and interrupt my page. So I know who sent you and I know it's the spirit of witchcraft. If you go watch, if you watch Catering My Way with Willie J. If you watch my show, you ain't finna get no bunch of cursing or nothing. This is clean content, all right? And it's sad that Facebook got to start finding people for cussing. That's sad. And I'm going to show y'all what I'm going to do with that next. Okay, we got some ragu. And I'm going to explain something to y'all also. I'm going to take some of this and put it in. Some of this is going to go on the pizza. And I'm going to add my mushrooms in just a minute when it's almost finished. Now, what you got to understand with me, my husband, and what we're trying to do, um, you may not use ragu. You might say, well, it's got a little sugar. Well, guess what? Our bodies already are telling us that we're doing better than what we were doing. Now, I may not do it perfect, 
but I'm just getting started. And so I'm doing better than what I was doing. Can you block that person? I definitely would. I love watching your feet. I'm not going to, I hope they got enough sense to go on. Every mom, I hope every mom taught their kids. If somebody don't want to be bothered with you, if they don't want to play with you, then you go on. But if you need scripture, it says if you enter into a man's house and there is peace, you leave it. I had peace over him. And if you enter into a man's house and there is no peace, get up and take your peace with you. That's all I can tell you. That's to the best of my ability. I'm going to cook anyway, and I'm going to have my content. All right, so in the ground beef right now, I haven't added no seasoning, but I'm about to. I'm about to add the mushrooms. I'm about to add my, and I know I'm out of my everything green. We're supposed to be working next week. All right. I got a little left. I'm going to shake it in the pasta. I got a little bit more, some bigger ones. All right. I'm going to go ahead now. This has got ground beef and sausage in it and onions and bell peppers. And this skillet could be bigger, but I'm going to use what I got. And I'm going to add mushrooms. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm not, you know, and I'm getting to the point, if this continue, I am going to just bless people with supporter badges and people that, you know, um, give me stars because... I can't decipher who with me and who ain't with me, you know, because I don't have a supporter room for you to be hanging out here to spy, but if you're going to keep on trying to come, you know, any kind of way, then no, you're not going to get blessed, okay, and it ain't predicated on money, it's predicated on trying to figure out who with me, okay, and some of you I already know that don't have supporter badges and stars, you send it in the mail, but now if it continues, because at one point, I was only feeding the senior citizens, all right? I was giving them the $200 a month. Then I started getting emails about Miss Tracy. That ain't fair. I'm a single mom. I'm struggling. Men struggling. You should give it to everyone. And everything I do to try to make y'all happy, you challenge me more and more and more. Find it not strange, but you do. And it's work. It is work. Every time I turn around, my page gets interrupted off of something somebody else is doing. what we're doing and I'm going to tell you why I'm standing right here for two reasons one I'm not going to get no grease on my backsplash the second reason is so you can see me okay do I need to go further back all right and then um I'm making um zucchini I'm going to move y'all so y'all can see it and right now I'm just browning this I'm going to drain it I'm not I'm not making it complex because um I'm going to use some of this also on the pizza 
All right, we also got pepperoni to go on the pizza. It's gonna be like a meat lover's pizza, okay? So that's why, it, you know, all the commotion is going on because I'm not, got my back turned towards y'all and I'm in, a, in my island. I'm cooking. Mother, I gotta call you, Mother Deborah Dunbar. I saw I had a missed call from you. I'm gonna give you a call. And look, y'all, y'all don't know how hard this is. I am standing. I am, I've been walking all day long. My husband can come testify. I walked, I walked in the store. I walked across the parking lot. I walked everywhere we went. We went shopping. I bought clothes. Um, and I'm gonna set y'all up a little higher. But let me show you what the, what the noodles are going to be so y'all don't be worried. So the noodles, <clears throat> which is off now, I blanched them. It's zucchini and squash. Okay, this is what it's going to be. You can't cook stuff but a little bit because remember the vegetables will get, they will get, and see that, that can separate stuff. They will get too, you know too mushy all right so that's what we got going on and then over here i'm just cooking on my island that's what i'm doing all right i love cooking i love doing what i do i thank god for miracles because he is working a miracle on me. He, he keeps doing great things. He keeps working miracles on me. The witchcraft people are mad today, honey. They're mad today. But he is still working miracles. And I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful. And I love me. Look at Aisha. Now y'all going to have to quit letting Aisha come through with all this stars and y'all ain't giving me none. Now come on now. Y'all can do better than that. Let me let me turn it down just a little bit. Uh-huh. There you go. I think that's that'll be a good fit for me. Some of these people are folks that don't like me on social media and they're hiding behind fake pages. And I think some of them are computer generated as well. Because if you comment too much as a real person, they will take you from giving stars, likes. They will block you and put you in Facebook jail. But they don't never see the negative stuff that people just randomly say. I think they're computer generated. I love you too, Aisha. Aisha, can you please email me your phone number? I had an opportunity to talk to a young lady today. Her name is Sharon, and that's all I'm going to give you. It's a lot of Sharons in the world. But what broke my heart is this Sharon had had a stroke. And she lives around her family. Her kids don't live near her. And it's the sad part that broke my heart. And I kept it together for her. I really did. And we're going to add some oregano in here too. Because we can use oregano in spaghetti and in pizza. But her family ain't even helping her. She stayed where she grew up. And her kids moved away. Now y'all, this is this what broke my heart. On Easter, nobody brought her a plate. Her arm is like this on the left side and so is her foot. She had to eat some fruit on Easter with family in her same time. Mm -mm. That ain't right. We're gonna add a little oregano. That ain't right. She had to eat fruit for Easter. My husband talked to her and I talked with her. She sent me her phone number to call her. And I did. We're gonna use some Italian seasoning now. Okay, because this is gonna also go on the pizza. All right. When we drain this, we're gonna also add us uh, some pesto because it's gonna go on the pizza as well. 
And with this pizza, I can make chicken. I can make chicken and um and um kale or whatever green I want to add to it. So when I tell y'all, I I I, I help out my tears. I've been there. You don't never know who's gonna help you. People are crying out. I have a sister that lives in Atlanta, and I gotta go stay with my sister. Even though I'm not too much in more better shape than she in, but she don't have no kids. And when your family tell you, she cried out to us and said, I miss y'all and the highway go both ways. And she right. Now, I don't drive in aggressive traffic. I have to get my son or my daughter to take me. But if God would take my sister away, I would be crying saying, I wish I could get to you. I wish we could do this and do that. I don't have to wait on those days. We got to do better because we will stretch our neck for everybody else. Look at my neck. I got a little neck. We'll stretch our neck for everybody else, but we're going to stretch it for our own family. Now, when Cain was asked, was he his brother's keeper? God knew Cain already had killed his brother. That didn't have nothing to do with Lee O'Brien, huh? Cain was jealous. watching them. They didn't do nothing to you. They did it to me. They ain't crazy. They know when people are should be dealt with and should not be. But they got to learn on their own. Okay? So here we have this. In here we got mushrooms. We got bell peppers. We got onions. We got everything green seasoning. We got some salt and pepper. And we got some oregano. When I drain it, we're going to add some pesto. And we're going to um, start incorporating some stuff into our sauce um, for um, our um, spaghetti and our pizza. We also put chicken pizza bread in the oven. What we did was we used three cans of canned chicken. We drained it. We put it in a bowl. We added two eggs. And we added... Parmesan cheese. We put the, it in the oven for 45 minutes on 450 degrees. That's going to be our pizza crust. When it comes out, we're going to use a little bit of this spaghetti sauce and we're going to um, top it off with the meat and some cheese and we got some pepperoni and we're going to use some of this meat as well. And we, we, we eating low carb. Now, I know you mad because you probably thought I wasn't going to do it. And I'm not talking to those that's with me. And I know that you are. But I'm here to tell you, you better be careful how you treat your neighbor. And your neighbor is anybody that ain't you. You better be careful how you treat your neighbor on a real deal. Because some people are about to get a rude awakening. Some people are about to wake up and they're going to think it's a nightmare. Because stuff is going to be going left and right. Money going to be dropping mm -hmm. off. You ain't going to boast and brag no more. I guess Mark said, y'all keep boasting and bragging that I'm paying y'all so much. I guess Mark said, well, I guess I better stop paying y'all so much money if you're going to boast and brag and keep on arguing and cracking up and y'all causing me to lose people. Um, that don't want to do commercials and because of what's your content. I might well just cut your pay. And I might as well put you in a category for cussing and for this and for that. This and that. This, this, this and that. <laughs> yeah, okay.
So I got a bowl and I'm gonna go over here. You see how I move that? And I'm gonna drain this. All right, we're gonna drain this meat. But listen, um, somebody tell the lady how to send stars. You have to buy them. Um, the star button is somewhere on there. I can't see it. Um, I thank you. But if you ain't got no money, don't send me none. My cash app can't go off anytime y'all want to give me something. But I meant it from the bottom of my heart. If you struggling and you got $30, don't you dare send me 10 I'm not playing with you on that. I meant it from the bottom of my heart. Don't you, don't you take your finger. And I know y'all think I'm crazy. Don't you take your finger. Don't you mash a star. Don't you do a cash app or a supporter badge. Don't do it for me. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. And I meant that. And I mean it from the bottom of my heart. You got to survive. Stuff is just rough right now. But it broke my heart. that grease will get we're gonna turn this off and we're gonna unplug it for now so none of, so so none of your grease well I leave it on because I'm gonna move that from over there to over here but you don't want none of this to get in your even if you got um a food process even if you got a what is that thing called uh the food thing you don't want to clog it up why can't you live near me Miss Ellen, I don't know, but I wish you can come visit me and I'll treat you good if you come see me. It's draining. Don't you dare. I can't sleep good at night. I don't know body not nobody whether you a senior citizen whether you young if you struggling let's just struggle together honey let's just struggle together i cook what i can when i can all right i gotta cook whether i'm on here or not but i i'm i, I mean heaven do y'all realize how close we getting and i can't let nothing I can't let nothing come come in my way. Mm mm. No, I can't. So what we're gonna do is work on the sauce. I'm gonna turn you back around. We're gonna get this skillet hot, okay? Let's go on back over here. There you go. Just right there. That's good for y'all. It's good for you. It's good for me. All right. We're gonna start while that while that meat draining. Let's just struggle together. I'll make it all right. That's why I didn't go buy no new house and no new cars. And I mean, and ain't nothing wrong if you did. Okay. I really want to take all of this. But after meat in it. Because I'm going to add pesto. I just get tired of just wanting to. Um, have peace and just cook. I don't, I don't, I don't have nothing against nobody. Okay, one jar of this pesto. Okay, it's gonna change this to something amazing. All right, and I'm gonna go put a little water in the pesto. Take this right here. You know how that song goes, Lord, I 
I don't bother nobody. I try to treat everybody the same. But every time I turn around, you know they scandalize my name. Oh, master, you don't have to move my mountain. But give me the strength to climb. The Lord, don't take away my stumbling block. Believe me all around. So, what I did was change this so that it'll have that pizza flavor and the spaghetti will be more Italian with the pesto. Okay? If you were eating authentic Italian food, you will know you got to have the pesto. So you will know. And on top of that, I'm going to add a little bit more of this here oregano. Avis came in late, but she him. Thank God you made it. And today I'm going to bless. I'm not going to bless because of pity. I'm going to bless for your, your willingness to be him. I'm going to bless because in spite of notifications being turned off in spite of this and that 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 and this you show up for me and i thank god all right so today yes i know i've given away a lot that's going to make it be a thousand dollars i'm gonna give a hundred dollars by the end of this live hold on y'all <clears throat> We got pepperoni too. And we have got 14 minutes. Let me look at that. Hold on, y'all. I don't want my stuff burnt. My stuff look like it's ready for me to add some sauce to it. Hold on, let me get it over here to y'all. Oh, master. You don't have to move my mountain, but give me the strength to climb. Now let's let's see what we finna do. Don't start all that popping everywhere. Get on over here. Get if you can't add right in the name of Jesus, I bind and rebuke and I'm gonna slide you over. So guess what? We finna get that crust. Mm-hmm. And what we gonna do with that crust? We finna keep letting that crust cook, but I ain't gonna overcook it. And I'm, I'm going to go by what I feel in my sha na 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 And we tend to um, spread some sauce on this crust and make this pizza and put the rest of this sauce in that spaghetti. <clears throat> Let me get it out. Ooh, you just have to feel it in your spirit, honey. Way down in your sanctified soul, cry holy. I got just what I wanted. I got just what I wanted. Got just what I wanted from the Lord. Got just what I wanted. I got just what I wanted. This is chicken crust. Honey, we did a new thing. Now what we're going to do is come over here, dip out some of that sauce. We're going to spread a little. One the pizza. Mm-mm. The Holy Ghost is what I wanted. Holy Ghost is what I wanted. The Holy Ghost is what I wanted from the Lord. The Holy Ghost is what I wanted. The Holy Ghost is what I wanted. The Holy Ghost is what I wanted from the Lord. And you can't make me doubt it. <laughs> you can't make me doubt it. You can't make me doubt it in my heart. 
You can't make me doubt him. I know too much about him. And you can't make me doubt him in my heart. I feel more determined. I feel more determined. I feel more determined in my heart. I feel more determined. I feel more determined. I feel more determined in my heart. Okay, and so next what we're going to do is we're going to add a little of the meat. And we're going to sprinkle some cheese. And we're going to put the pepperoni. Or do you put the cheese first? For some reason, I think you put cheese first, then some meat. Do anybody know which one you put down first? Is it the meat and then the cheese? Or do you put the cheese down and then sprinkle the meat? And sprinkle it again. How do y'all want me to do it, friends? Y'all want me to put some cheese down first? And then sprinkle with some meat? Okay. I just saw somebody say cheese. LaSheria said cheese. LaSheria Harris, some of my sister said cheese. She said cheese. She said cheese. I'm gonna go with what she said was first thing I seen was what she said. She, she said that. Lala said it. We're gonna put a little, 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 little. Give me a little room, 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 little room. We're gonna put a little cheese down. Not much, but enough, okay? This is a meat lover's place God. Okay, now we're gonna put us some meat and pepperoni and I don't know what you want on your pizza, but it's not pan pan. Y'all know these things get on your nerves. Trying to open it the right way so that I can reseal it, but I might have to just use a Ziploc bag. All right, and let me give me some of that meat real quick. Pepperoni. Okay. Hold on, I can't see what y'all saying. Hold on. Yes, I'm making pizza. And this is um this pizza has um a chicken crust. Okay. So pepperoni going everywhere. We're going to top it with cheese, right? We're going to see how it turn out. Some more on top um, pepperoni when I put the cheese. I think so. So I'm just gonna put just a few more. Okay. It's a chicken crust. Okay, so, we, so it can be low carb and we can have pizza and we don't feel left out like everybody else that's skinny can eat bad because they're skinny. And, and you know, some people feel that way. All right. I'm 
gonna put it back in the oven. This is oregano, you know. You need it for your pizza. Okay. And um, we're gonna add a little more pepperoni. So it can curdle up all on top, like when you order them. And then we're gonna do the spaghetti. Yeah, like that. And if it turns out good, we'll make another one on the weekend because I have to have my vegetables. And I was reading with carbs, they don't even want you to have a lot of vegetables. Um, ain't that something? It's the protein, really. That's what it is. It's the protein. Okay, so now it's getting ready to go back in the oven. Okay, it's still on 400. I'm gonna slide it back in the oven, and then we're gonna work on the spaghetti. Okay. Let me open the oven first. Messing up. Hold on one second, y'all. Bake. 400. Start. And timer. Start. Okay. All right. Now we're going to work on the spaghetti. Right? Y'all do good, honey. Ain't we, ain't we moving? We're moving. We sure are. We're going to get everything ready for the spaghetti. And yes, I'm going to be meticulous about my kitchen. I just got it. Why wouldn't I be? I'm gonna get a lower baller so you can see what the what the spaghetti is gonna look like. I'm gonna get a smaller baller. one that's okay we'll use this one what I'm gonna do is put it on the eye so that it can cook okay so what we're gonna do is add the sauce into this is um squash and zucchini okay so I'm gonna go ahead and add this sauce in here Put it on the eye. I'm gonna add that meat that we had over there draining. And I'm going to move it on back on top of the eye and pull the eye where you can see me. All right. 
Vou pôr esse macho lá. And um, Ava is on her way home. We're gonna stir this up. I'm gonna add a little more water, like we do our spaghetti sauce. I'm gonna add a little bit more. And I didn't mix the ground beef up at that time, but remember, you don't want to do too, too much because these are not noodles. These are vegetables. I just bought this. This is Quizmax. This is C-U-S-I um, Max. I got it off of Amazon. Okay. And we're going to get all that goodness worked in here. And this is spaghetti. And you know what I'm missing that I need to add? I got to see if I got any. I'm going to add a little liquid. <clears throat> but I need some stewed tomatoes. I don't know if I got any. Let me add a little more liquid. Oh. to stretch that spaghetti sauce. Cause that's what my mama did. I'm gonna let y'all look into this pot. And y'all know if I had some stewed tomatoes, that's all I'm missing. That is all I am missing. Okay? And some stewed tomatoes. And I'm gonna add a little sprinkle of sugar because I always put a little sugar and my spaghetti. So y'all come on and get in this pot and let me show y'all what I'm doing. Come on over here. And I'm gonna turn y'all down some more. Mm -hmm. Hold on. At least I was gonna try to. Turn you down. There you go. Okay, you in that nephew riding? Y'all in that pot? Y'all all the way in there? Y'all all the way in there? Let me set you up a little higher because I want to make sure you're all the way in there. I know what you told me. Let's see if this helps. Y'all in there? Can y'all see now? All the way in that pot. do just for a little bit and everything is with moderation I don't care if it's low carb I ain't gonna sit here and just eat all day long I can't, I can't eat no whole pack of That's what we working with. And that's what we did. And it's gonna start to simmer. Let me turn it around. It's gonna start to simmer. And I thank God for everything. And I'm sorry y'all, I haven't been reading comments. I was just cooking. Sometimes I can read them and sometimes I can't. All right, don't that look yummy? Sometimes you don't feel like you're missing nothing. People don't know. I done told y'all over and over. Everybody don't know everything about everybody. I don't make sweet spaghetti. But I grew up because I have acid reflux and sugar. The sugar can help with a little bit of your acid. It really can your sugar can, a little sugar, you don't have to go crazy. It'll help you with some acid. 
So, to all you MCs, I hope y'all real good listeners. I'm, I'm learning and I'm doing it on my own. Hey, Dandelion, I love you. I'm going to call you. Um, I just need to call you. Yeah, sugar helps with the acidity. It does. Yes, it does. And um, it's a pretty day here today. Y'all want to see what it looked like? I can turn the camera around to the backyard. You'll see some trees. Okay, baby. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to push y'all up so y'all can see what's going on outside. Nothing. It's just a pretty day in the neighborhood. A beautiful day for neighbors. Won't you be my neighbor? Don't y'all miss good old movies and TV like that? We'll be checking at Peaks in just a little bit. I'm washing my dishes and I know I need to use my dishwasher, but I ain't used it yet. And it's alright. I might be too country for some of you all. But I am who I am today. Because God used my mistakes. And he ended up working for my job. people on my page, they don't want to hear one drop about the Lord, but they want you to pray for them. I was, I, I'm getting to the point, you better pray for yourself. You really need to pray for yourself. Cause I am who I am today. Because God is my mistake. He worked them for my good Like no one else ever could He told me to tell you today It was necessary <laughs> Yes, sir so I am who I am today Because God used my mistakes He worked them for my good I know one else ever could he told me to tell you today. God told me he's always making a way. He told me to tell you today. It was necessary. Yes, sir. It was necessary. Had I not went through it, I wouldn't have known he could do it. If I never had a problem, I wouldn't know he could solve it. So it was necessary. It was necessary. We're going to check that pizza. 
Come on over here. I don't care what nobody says. I'm going to I'm gonna sing. Don't use my... Di I don't use no dish one. I'm glad I got one. I ain't getting it. Y'all, listen. <laughs> we got two minutes left. And we're going to take that, that pizza out. All right? And this um, spaghetti is doing this thing. We can take that pizza out and the spaghetti. Honey, I grew up and I am Pentecostal. By all means, not by organization, but by the full gospel of the word. And if you don't like it, then if you don't love me, then don't talk to me. Go ahead and free yourself. You don't love me, then don't talk to me. Why don't you go ahead and free yourself? What's the matter? You don't love me, then don't talk to me. Talk to me. Tell him, Danny. Go ahead and free yourself. That part, if you don't love me, you shouldn't talk to me. I promise you I'll be okay. All right, I'm going to put my glasses on. Who done passed away? My, my condolences, whoever it is. And I'm going to get it out. If you don't go through it, it would, honey, if I never had a problem. And when I one day, I want y'all to get y'all tissue on Zoom. Because I'm going to start telling you different parts of my life. Amen. It ain't for everybody. It's for the people that come on Zoom because everybody ain't with me. And you're going to turn your camera on and hear my testimony. And I'm going to see your face. And if you are a Judas, baby, remember Judas killed himself. Come on, somebody. Come on in a room. Let me turn this off. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Oh, come on. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. Oh, come on. Come on. Well, here we go. Here we go. Well, come on. When you know that you know that you know that you mean business and you don't need nobody to tell you you need to lose no weight. But when you tell people that you're going to step in the name of love, <laughs> that's why, that's when you, you got to have something to look for. No, I didn't find them. I done lost the other ones. Don't tell nobody, Miss Georgie. Now, this ain't no piece of crust. This ain't got no bread on it. So, oh, so, Y'all better see. Danielle, go ahead and take the picture. Get it in there, Danielle. Then I'm going to hold it up so you can take it again with me in there. You got it, Dandelion? And I know her and Jean going to get it. And your spaghetti is right here doing this thing. All right? Now let me sit y'all right here. So I can hold this pizza up like I'm a professional. Uh -huh. Let me pick it up. <laughs> let me let me tilt it forward a little bit. Let me pick it up. <laughs> let me take my glasses off. Here we go. Okay. Somebody got it. If not, I'll go back and get it. All right. Now, the spaghetti. The getty. And I'm done. I've been cleaning my kitchen as I went. I got a few things to put up. My pots are washed. And um, my husband can eat. And when Ava get home, she will know the difference. I hope she don't. Because if she don't, she on her journey. To less carbs. All right. Now let's check out this here pasta. That's supposed to be pasta. Mm-hmm. See? You just gonna get it going real good. And you ain't gonna mess with it too much. Because remember, this is vegetables. All right? So we got that simmering and cooking. I didn't have no stewed tomatoes. Because if I had some. But you do know what I'm gonna do. 
As soon as it get going good, I'm just going to shake a little Parmesan in there probably. Mm-hmm. And I might just take a little bit and sprinkle a little. Um, and you can bake it and put it in the oven if you want to. And that pizza right there. So what I did now, I did that. You did that. No, uh-uh, down, down the line. No, I thought you was on here when I started. Mm -mm. That ain't cauliflower. Down the line, that's chicken crust. I used three cans of chicken. I drained them. I used two white and one dark. But just use white if you want to. And then I busted two eggs in there. And I shook Parmesan cheese. About two of these Parmesan John cheeses in there. And I made sure it was real dry. Put it in the oven uh, for 35 minutes because I shaved a little time off. And then I made my pizza. And I, I can't wait to see how it turns out. I believe it's going to be all right. I need to cut it, but I probably need to let it sit just to squash it in. I need a cutter. A pizza cutter. And I have one. I know I have a pizza cutter. Because I keep one. So I'm going to see if it's ready to be cut. All we can do is try it out. Okay? That's all we can do is try it out. So over here, come on. I'm going to turn y'all this way. I'm going to touch y'all so y'all can see it for y'all own self. Your own self self. Okay? Y'all good? Y'all close enough? I don't want to get my phone too hot. I probably need to sit a little bit, but look at him. I got pizza. Ooh wee. Hold on, y'all. Let me get a plate. And I'm going to upload this on YouTube. Yeah. Mm. Oh man. Mm-hmm. Mm. Let me turn it around. Look. Y'all, it's got a crust on it for real. Mm. I did that, that right now, right chance I did. I'm gonna shake a little Parmesan on him. This might be one of our go-tos. That's hot. This might be one of our go-tos. I'm gonna have to cut it. Cause I'm human and my fingers are burning. Hey, Deborah Williams from um Winterville, North Carolina, my friend. Deborah, you could have had a piece. Oh, gone it. Deborah, don't be pushing stuff out my hand. Lord, bless him and stretch it in Jesus' name. Amen. Mm. Mm. Mm mm mm. Mm mm mm. Mm mm mm. Baby, it's a whole pizza. I feel guilty. I feel guilty. I made the crust out of chicken. Baby, I feel guilty. It look like I'm cheating. Mm-hmm. 
I feel like I'm cheating. Now let me try some spaghetti. Come on. And this is all I'm gonna eat. Cause I don't really eat as much as y'all think. Oh, my stomach be bothering me sometimes. Okay, get some spaghetti. Spaghetti. Oh. Let me turn it down. Well, let me take a bite first. See, I've been on um, low carbs before, and I learned a lot. I don't know. Mm, 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 mm. All I'm missing is a salad. Mm, mm, mm. All I'm missing is a salad. I'm going to put that little stuff up on my counter. And I've been catching up on my shows. I just feel like I'm cheating though on my diet. Mm. Down the line, come to this pizza. And some spaghetti. Baby, I feel a senior citizen. I take a senior citizen about 435. And I'm on here talking to y'all. I'm about to go to sleep. Mm, mm, mm. Um, I, that's the um, chicken crust I took I took three cans of chicken white meat and um, I drained it to squeeze it out good then I added two eggs some everything green some um, oregano and I added um, Parmesan cheese. Mm. I pressed it. I don't have a friend battling cancer in Chicago. Um, BK, I don't know who you're talking about. I don't have a friend in Chicago battling cancer. No, I don't. My friend from Chicago just came to visit. So I'm not quite sure. You might have me mixed up with another content creator. But over here, I know the ones that's battling. I don't, I don't know how you can remember that so well. And I wouldn't. So I don't have a friend. Thank you, though. Mm-hmm. The egg and the Parmesan cheese, Sheila, is a binder. That's what's going to make the crust stay together. And you put it in the oven for 35 to 45 minutes. 45 minutes, real. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Sometimes I think something happened to some of us. Um, people will come over here and speak deaf over folks like deaf can't be spoken over them. Now that person going to come on here and ask me about somebody. I would know who in my crew that had cancer. That's not nothing to play with. You better be careful for this stuff fall back on y'all. That's witchcraft. Y'all better go on. Demons and witches and warlocks. Y'all not welcome. BK Franklin, I ain't let you. I, let me tell you something, BK. I'm gonna put this like this. Everybody over here is good. 
Thank you for asking. Thank you for asking. I don't know why your mind is on fixated on one person. I did have a friend die from cancer, but she didn't live in Chicago. Then, Kevin, you know who he talking about? Anybody else know who this, this man talking about? Does anybody else know who he's talking about? I don't. I have no earthly idea. I'm asking somebody else because for me, I, I can't remember. All I know is all is well. I have, we have no clue, baby. It could be somebody else. I have no idea who you talk to on the phone. So I think you get me mixed, sir, you get me mixed up with another content creator. But I pray whoever you're talking about, it's okay. Uh-uh, Mac 10 didn't live in Chicago. And I can't recall nobody else. Oh, I don't know who you're talking about, sir. I keep telling you, everybody is well. I don't know who you're talking about in Chicago. Um, we're all doing good. So, I don't know. It, you might got me mixed up with somebody else. And that's okay. Yeah, Brandy, she lives in Chicago, but she don't have cancer. She has diabetes. Oh, you're a woman. Okay. Well, ma'am, um, the only person I know, Brandy, and Brandy don't have cancer. She has diabetes. If you're talking about the one whose feet and um, fingers had to be amputated, she has diabetes. But it's okay. She's doing good, too. All right. No, she didn't have cancer, though, Tiffany. She's talking about Brandy. Mo didn't have cancer. <clears throat> she, she just, she don't mean no harm. She just got it mixed up. No, it's all right. At least she asked, and she said she was on her mind. Yeah, it, it's, it's Brandy, um, BK. It's Miss Brandy. She doing good. She checks on us. Let me show y'all this pizza. Yeah, it, it was. It's not cancer. It just she had not just okay. I don't mean it in that way. We made this. Okay. That's why I just said she she is all right. She's all right. She at least she thought about it. It's no big deal. She just said the wrong thing, but she still asked about and was concerned about somebody. And thank her, thank God that she concerned, because too many people ain't concerned about nobody. And there go your spaghetti, and I'm done. Miss BK, you didn't offend me. I just didn't know who you was talking about. And I'm glad you took the time to ask, because so many people don't ask about nobody. So thank you. Thank you very much. It was just, I didn't know who you was talking about, because I knew nobody from... Chicago had passed from it. It's gone. It's over with. Debra knows. I'm a nose too, Debra. I'm certainly a K N O W L E S. Born and dead. And I will be a nose forever, even when I'm dead. I love you back, Miss um, BK. Oh, yeah, AA enjoying herself. AA is enjoying herself. Did you show the recipe? That looks. Yeah, I already cooked it, um, Janet, um, Janet, um, Janet Poppins. So, listen. To make the pizza crust, I use three cans of chicken, the large chicken in a can. And you squeeze it and you drain it just like you would do uh, anything else that's got liquid. And I busted two eggs in there. And I added Parmesan cheese instead of flour. And I put it on 400 in the oven for 45 minutes. Okay? 
That's how I made the crust. Then after that, I used the same ragu. And in the, inside the ragu, I put pesto. And I, um, I also put some of my seasoning on my, on my vegetables, which is spinach and zucchini. And then I brown bell peppers, onions, ground beef, sausage, and mushrooms. All right. And then um, I begin to take the sauce because I did the sauce by itself, and I placed it on the pie crust when on the on the crust when it came out. And then we added mozzarella cheese, pepperoni, the meat, and the sauce. We put it in the oven for 15 minutes. So all my stuff is finished. And all I got to do now is take me a little breather and I might come back and bake. And I'm thinking, I'm trying to hold off because I'm going to get this cake. When I make this red velvet cake, somebody locally going to get it. But I'm trying to hold off um, because I want to do a pound cake. If you have not registered, please register for Catering My Way. I'm going to donate a heavenly pound cake in this giveaway. And um, also Sweet Creations by Melinda G. The reason why I took her post down is because I need y'all to cash up her, not me. I need y'all to cash up dollar sign Melinda, M-E-L-I-N-D-A, Grayson, G-R-A-Y-S-O-N, 100. If you want to be a part of her Mother's Day, uh, it's $150 for Maness products. And also, you're going to win a cake and a few more things, okay? $5 entry. And um, treat yourself sometime. But do y'all help? Do y'all want me to go on and end this live and I can come back and talk to y'all? I do want to talk to you, Linton, about something. Linton, I'm worried about some things and some things I'm not. I just see it happening before my eyes. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to fix my husband a plate. I'm going to straighten my kitchen up. I ain't got much. I promise you, I don't wash my dishes. Um, I'm going to put the, the, the few things I got to put up off my counter. And um, I'm going to come back. Yeah, I made a pizza, but it's not out of bread. All right? I'm going to sit down and come talk to y'all. I'm going to fix my husband a plate. All right then, Sheila Chief. And um, that's what I'm gonna do. Um, because when they do my professional photo shoot on the 15th, I want to have a heavenly pound cake and probably a red there, but it's something sitting out. All right, so I'm gonna finish straighten up, fix Eddie's plate, and then um, uh, call Danielle. And that's it. I'm gonna, I gotta let this phone charge a little bit. So I'm gonna make a quick call to her. All right, I love y'all. I'm back in a cream cheese. You baking one now? Oh yeah. I got one with a cream cheese surprise. Oh man, it's good on the inside. I love y'all. Hey, Bridget Stevens. I'll see y'all later. Honeybees.